So today's video is going to come to you in two parts. Part The first is going to be book news. Okay, so in book news today, we have an exciting turn of events. Bone Shaker has been finished. Ooh, I got to the end. Very good book. It was pretty, I enjoyed it. Uh, it took me a while, but it was still very good. And I think you're reading it next, so I still can't give any spoilers. We need to start finishing these books so we can actually like talk with spoilers. But... Hopefully you'll enjoy this one. It's definitely not in the Discworld. Uh, it's a very different kind of book uh, from the Discworld books, but it was still very good, and I enjoyed it. And as we discussed last week, up next was Eric, which I just started. I didn't get very far. I just like read the last couple seconds of my commute, so I got like five pages in. But it's very good so far. It's funny. It's in the Discworld, so. It has all the Ter Terry Pratchett charm that you have come to expect when you open a Discworld book. Um, this one seems to have uh, death as a major player, um, considering that's how the book starts. So I'm excited about that because the books with death are actually very funny, which you wouldn't think necessarily, but death's a pretty funny guy. So I am looking forward to finishing this one. It's very short. It's only 148 pages, so I don't. it's not going to take me very long. So, for my up next book this week, I'm going to read Scarlet. Okay, so I have started Scarlet. I started it like a year ago, maybe? I don't know. But uh, I never got a chance to finish it just because of school and work and everything got insane. So, I am now going to finish reading it. Uh, I might have, I think I'll like skim through the first bit because I don't really remember that much about this book. I remember it's a Robin Hood kind of different take on Robin Hood, so that should be interesting. Um, but I'm very excited. It's an autograph copy too, so Ooh. <laughs> I got this book a really long time ago, and I've been meaning to finish it. So this is up next, and that's about it for book news today. Ooh. Okay, part two of this video is really cool glass water bottles that I found really really cheap, and I'm really excited about it right now. I just used really like 8,000 times, so you know. It's awesome. Okay, so you know how glass water bottles are always like $25, and it's kind of ridiculous because like I'm not paying $25 for a water bottle, that's absurd. But these guys, this guy and this guy, I got them at Marshall's today, and they were really cheap. This one was $4.99, and then this one was $5.99, and they're glass water bottles with the silicone coating, and they're pretty cool, and I like them. <laughs> so hopefully I'll be I'll use these and see how they work out, and I'll let you know. And but they were so cheap, I was like, well, I might as well try them, see how see how they work. Uh, they should be a little easier to clean than the plastic, and they shouldn't get that like weird smell, like you know the smell plastic water bottles get when you've had them for too long. <clears throat> it's like I don't know. Probably is leaching something terrible into my water and that will slowly kill me later, but hopefully that won't happen with these or I'll die from something else with these. That's fine. But for the meantime, these are really cool and I will let you know how they work. So, okay, so that about does it for my video today. I'm looking forward to seeing your videos soon or someday, hopefully when work gets a little better. Um, so I can't wait to see your response to the art assignment that I had from the other week and the uh, Pumpkin Fest video that is coming someday. Maybe I'll come on Halloween. Who knows? Probably won't. That's okay. Uh, and that about does it for me. So, bye!